But Cal Rittenhouse, he go to a convention in Phoenix, and he gets his uh, a unique, unique uh, greeting. You know what I'm saying? And I was kind of, I'm not surprised to see it. And I'm kind of find it funny. I know some people might not find it funny, but I find it funny. So let me pull this video out real quick. Right. A young all right, here we it go. is something that we must all take a step back and say, if they can indict a young boy at the time, now a young man, for simply defending himself when his life was in danger, they can come after every single one of you. So ladies and gentlemen, please, let's get loud for Kyle Rittenhouse. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> I know people ain't feeling that. I ain't gonna lie. I'm all for the Cal Rittenhouse uh, introduction. I'm all for it, yo. I'm all for it. G Torres, welcome, welcome. Yo, I'm gonna play this one more time for y'all because I'm all <laughs> for it, yo. Defending himself when his life was in danger, they can come after every single one of you. So, ladies and gentlemen, please. <laughs> Let's get loud for Kyle Rittenhouse. Yo, it's an air horn for me. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> It's tough. Let me know in the comments. Do y'all think that's tough that how he came out? Yo, he came out, you know what I'm saying? Like, yo, I bet you uh, two years ago, he would never imagine that he would have an introduction to a conference like this. Kyle Rittenhouse probably never thought he'd have a uh, uh, an introduction to a conference like this. Look how loud this is, yo. <laughs> Yo, the song is, the song is getting me, I ain't gonna hold you. I appreciate this dude, yo. I ain't gonna hold you, I appreciate Kyle Rittenhouse. You know what I'm saying, like... Kyle, <laughs> the Kyle, 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 Kyle. I'm glad people could appreciate that. I'm glad people could appreciate that because I definitely do. You know what I'm saying? Um, during the trial, I always thought that Kyle Rand House was innocent. Uh, I, I guess I could put a link. I just put in um, Kyle Rand House Phoenix. I put in Kyle Rand House um, Phoenix. Damn, what did I put in? Oh, man. Yeah, it's called Kyle Rand House Get a Standing Ovation. That's the name of the title of the video. But, um,. I'm a fan of it, yo. I'm a fan of it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. You know, saying people dislike Kyle Rittenhouse because they said that <laughs> people came in, you know, people say they ain't like Kyle Rittenhouse because, you know, he shot uh, people out of Black Lives Matter rally or protest or riot or whatever, however you want to put it. They said he did that. I get it. Maybe he did, he didn't. But, um, no, actually, he did. But it's the way that they put it, like, oh, he shot black people. He didn't do that. It's like, I hated the way they, they put Kyle Rittenhouse out there. I hated how they put them out there. And, you know what I'm saying? 
it just, it's like a little bit of trolling me. I'm glad that he got off. I'm glad he got off. And I'm glad that he getting standing ovations like this. I'm glad that he has an intro song coming out like this. America first. You know what I'm saying? People got their phones up, their GoPros recording for Kyle Rittenhouse. Like, yo, this dude's a superstar among the um, conservative world. And I appreciate that. I appreciate that. I'm not, I don't really call myself a conservative or a liberal, or whatever, but I do appreciate things like this. You know what I'm saying? So, Kyle Rittenhouse, you know, salute to you that you get in this. Uh, standing ovation from these folks right here, and you know what I'm saying, and also salute to you for having your own theme song coming out, and um, the air horns, salute to the air horns too, you know what I'm saying, I have my own air horns, um, you know what I'm saying, I do have my own air horns on here on my little switchboard, but Kyle Rittenhouse is the man, yo, he's the man, he came out like a wrestler, you know what I'm saying, he's not really built athletically, but it's dope to see somebody not athletically built to get that attention, now it's like um it's kinda like like somebody built like me and Gene Oakland or like Jim Ross coming out and getting that that love. You know what I'm saying? That's what that that's what it reminds me of, man. I am alright, before I before I drop this 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 thing, I'm gonna just do this one more time, man, because this is dope. Indict, I got my own a young too. boy at the time, now a young man, is simply defending himself when his life is in danger. They can come after every single one of you. So, ladies and gentlemen, please let's get loud for Kyle Rittenhouse. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Kyle, 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 Kyle. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, man. Um, I think I think it's a little troll at LeBron James, low key, because he said he said he was a LeBron James fan after um. You know, he's a LeBron James fan. He's no longer a fan of his no more after he, you know, he made fun of him crying on the stand. And you remember LeBron James when he came out for the Heat? He came out like this too. So maybe it was a little shot. Maybe it was a little shot at LeBron James. That's what I think. Maybe it was a little shot at LeBron James that he did this. Oh, uh, nah. How you gonna say they racist? <laughs> Oh man, it's a big one. Pause. You, you take up the whole screen. I don't think this is arrogant. I think this is arrogant. I, I understand we he was found guilty, but he still killed two people and injured someone else because of negligence. Why are we celebrating murder? We're not celebrating murder. We're celebrating the um the, the Second Amendment right. That's what we're celebrating. You know what I'm saying? That's Kyle Rittenhouse right there. Kyle Rittenhouse. He's an American hero. He's Kyle Rittenhouse right now is um, the Y2K version or the Y2K21 or 22 version, I should say, of Hulk Hogan. He's the closest thing to Hulk Hogan that these kids have right now, in my opinion. So, you know, he's going to start telling kids to eat better. He, he's going to help these kids out because he's, he's more relatable to these kids. So he's going to tell kids to eat better. And the parents of these kids are going to appreciate Kyle Rittenhouse being that role model for their kids, yo. Thank you for watching. This is a clip from my weekly show, Wednesday Night Live, every Wednesday at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you enjoy this content, please hit subscribe and turn on notifications. Also, check out these other videos that I have available as well. Thank you.